What's up guys it's Ritesh here from Ritesh Tech back with another video and today I'm going to show you all how you can remap hardware buttons including capacitive touch buttons on your Android phone. Basically assign different actions to different hardware buttons. Maybe to increase functionality as per your usage. So to do this you need an app called Buttons Remapper which is available on the Play Store for free. So just head over to the description of this video and click on the first link that you find. It will take you to the Play Store page of this app. Download and install this app. It's a very light app so won't take long to download. Next, open it. Now to get this app to work, you have to enable accessibility service. So tap on this button and hit continue. Enable the remap button settings. Go back to the app. Now to remap any hardware button, tap on this add sign. Select short and long press. Select the key that you want to remap. It shows all the buttons apart from the power button. Next select long press if you want the same functionality for the button. And finally select the action from the provided actions list. Also if you want to force your action and give it priority over any system action then select block system actions. Finally hit OK and test if it actually works. As you can see the camera app does open when I long press the volume up button. I can even swap the back and menu button functionality. Now if you feel this way comfortable you can have the left button to go back and the right button that was the back button to show recent apps. Overall it's a pretty useful app for someone who wants to remap Android hardware buttons to his or her likings. And yeah that was a pretty quick tutorial on how to do that. I hope you found this video helpful. If you did then don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel to get notified about my future videos. Also do visit my channel and check my other content. Thanks for watching guys and I will see you all in the next one.